There's this really cool YouTuber called Lord DIY, and if you don't know who she is, I don't even know how you wouldn't. She has like 8 million subscribers, maybe even more than that. I'm not really sure. I can't keep track. But anyway, she has this really cool like craft line with Michaels and Walmart and Target, and I've been dying to try some of her like craft supplies, so I decided that I would make a whole video out of trying one of her DIY kits. So I went to Walmart and I chose one of them. Today we're going to be doing the balloon animal. If you guys didn't know this, I actually worked at a party store for like three years and I made hardly any balloon animals, but I worked with balloons a lot. So I thought this would just be a really cute one to do for today's video. Let's just go forth and attempt to do this DIY. See how easy it is, if it's easy, if it's hard, if it looks cute at the end, if I'm capable of lore DIY greatness. Let's find out. I'm just gonna cut this bad boy open. Okay, so we have a baggie and then we have the heck? I'm assuming this is the fluff, but this is the most weirdest looking fluff I've ever seen. It's like, it looks like dehydrated food. Instructions and a wooden dowel. I hate reading instructions. I almost just want to wing it, but probably shouldn't do that. We have the corn. There's a little tiny baggie of sequins some string and then we have all these little strips of cool looking material i'm assuming this is for the tail lore diy glue and the final thing we have is a big long tube of felty feeling stuff <laughs> it wasn't as crazy as i thought it was gonna be nobody told me i was gonna need a ruler you used to live two doors down from me you let me in when I lost my Okay, so now I have all these like strings cut and there's a lot of them So I'm gonna be surprised if we end up using them all So the first thing that we have to do is like tie off the end to make the nose Love, I swear we were. Next add filling and gently push it with the stuffing tool to fill a space about 3.5 eight, about, about 8 centimeters in length friends, So don't take us back to how we were We always do First, it feels like it's gonna take forever to get the fluff in, but once you kind of like figure out like how to do it, it doesn't take as long. And if it didn't come with this stick, this would be impossible. I'm just gonna tie it off. For the ears, so we're gonna do the same thing with the next two sections, but make them a little bit smaller, and then I guess we're gonna like fold it. Cue the B-roll. Let me catch feelings I had to lose. Can't let it get to that. The part I want you back. We know we're nothing but bad news. We always do what we do. I think that is the head so far. We got some ears going on here. So we have to do the neck, the legs, the, the body, and then the last legs. So we make a bate. You turned it <laughs> Oh my god, this conversation. I'm done. You can look if you want to know. There's a part of me that still wants to, wants to think about you. Oh, but if I go there, I'm just gonna spend another night. We always do what we do. Don't let me stay another night. Oh, I, I made the legs too short. I thought they were supposed to be six centimeters, but they're supposed to be eight. That's two centimeters. Off each leg? I mean, the, the legs are supposed to be as long as the neck. Look how short they are. <laughs> legs too short I have like a lot of extra at the end so I'm gonna have to end up like cutting it because then he's just gonna have to be a really like stubby legged unicorn he's just gonna have extra short legs and that's all there is to it so yeah I'm just gonna cut some of this off and then we have to just 
tie all these little babies together. Ooh, he's gonna have a really long tail. You're so bad. His tail's gonna be coming out of his pooper. On our body, he doesn't like to stand very well because, and his leg's too small. So now that the body is done, there's literally just two things left. So I have to fill up his little corn. <laughs> I have to fill up his little horn and glue it onto his head. All I have left to do is to glue these little sequins on, and the instructions say I can glue them wherever I want. With you, we said we were Don't let me stay another night. No, stay another night. With you, stay another night. Stay another night. Stay another night. With you. finished balloon animal plushy unicorn and my overall thoughts is that it is cute however I think I may be a little bit above the demographic that this was made for it would have turned out better if I had read the instructions correctly and made the legs the right size so if anybody out there wants to make this um, read the sizing and the measurements that you're supposed to be doing because mine turned into like a little wiener dog um, unicorn yeah, I think it's super cute. I'm glad I got to try one of Lore DIY's like DIY kit. If you guys want to see me try any more of Lauren's DIY collection or like her DIY kits, let me know in the comments down below. I think it'd be fun to do one of like her DIY jewelry sets because they look super cute. I think it's super cool that Lore DIY has a line in freaking Walmart. Like I feel like you know you made it when you know you, when you have like a line in Walmart. But yeah, with all that being said, let me know in the comments if you like my unicorn. Feel free to give him a name down there. And don't forget to follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, my other two channels. Everything will be linked in the description box below. And I'll see you guys very soon with a brand new video.